Listen to the noise this friggin PS4 is making. Need to buy a new one. So here we go guys, Ascension Pack-A-Punch. I'm sure plenty of you have actually played it. And uh, a lot of you haven't. But obviously as you guys, if you guys don't know, it starts off in black and white. Now this is the first thing you actually want to watch out for. This will spawn around for about three times around and it will spin around like this. And if you get hit by it, you will go down. So that's one thing you do need to wa watch out for. But yeah, for the purpose of this video, guys, I'm going to be doing this whole process without gobble gums. Just going to be showing you guys how you can pack a punch and get some good upgraded weapons. Oh, just not like this. Here we are. So we're on round three. We've got 2,800 points. We'll start opening up some of the doors. I'm just going to show you one way. There's actually two ways you can go. Here it goes again, see? You can go that way. But for the p purpose of this video, I'm going to go this way. So yeah, once you've come to this area, you want to actually open up this door. 1250 is a bit costly. Right, is there a war bite? There's a cuda here. Hello. That's new, that is. That wasn't there before. So yeah, just pick up a war bite, any gun that takes your fancy, just so you can have something to use to help you build up the points and protect yourself from the zombies. So to recap, you've come this way from spawn. You've opened this door for 1250. You want to head into this building here. The door, This door is already open, so this is free of charge. That way takes you to doors Juggernog. And then you want to come up here all the way up again to the main part of the root building. And you need, I need... Uh, 110 more points so now you can open up this door the power switch will be right by here and that is how you get the power on in ascension the mystery box will always spawn here no oh, look at the colors on this oh i've only just this is my first time playing the map so uh, this is literally orgasmic for me right i'm gonna save up have a hit on the box oh we've got a nuke right if we get the thunder gun you have to subscribe to the channel right now give me something good go on you know you want to dracon I was hoping for like a Galil or an M16, but whatever. So now guys, there are three landers that you need to use. They are scattered across the map, but by using these, you need to use each one, each, yeah, each one once, and that will trigger the rocket launch test sequence to begin. Now once you've done that, you can activate that, and that is how to get a pack a punch. And that's basically what you have to do. But I'm obviously going to show you and demonstrate the best ways and like where all the locations are and everything you need to know, because this is a how to pack a punch tutorial. It wouldn't just be like me explaining how to pack a punch, it's, how, it's showing you how to pack a punch. So actually, funny enough, the first location is just up here. This is probably, if you guys are beginners to this map and you haven't played it too much, this is where I'd recommend training. So here we are, we're going to call the land as a position. Now don't be fooled, that isn't the actual activation. You have to spend 250 points to move it. And uh, yeah, I'll wait for it to come and then we'll go. So you don't want to stand in there either, otherwise you're going to die. So we are, this is going to take you back to the spawn room. And then there's two more locations we need to do after this. So I'll show you the best routes to take from spawn to get to them here now. Yeah, so here we go. That's one of three. And now you'll see this rocket priming thing. It's all flash green a bit. The next one will take us up to about by here. And then once we've done, it'll be fully primed. And then we can launch the rocket, which in triggers Pack-A-Punch door to open. So once you leave in the spawn room, you want to take these stairs and take a left. This door costs 1,000. It used to be 1,250, I believe. That's where the AK-74U is. Is that the best that they've replaced it with? Yeah. But then you're going to have another door here for 1,250. Open that. And then you'll come into your second lander location. So yeah, here we are, the second lander location. Once again, we're going to fly back to spawn in the lander for 250 points. Let's just rack up the money a bit here, though, since all the zombies are coming in. But yeah, here we go. Let's launch our second lander. And we're going to be two-thirds of the way there to get in our pack punch open, boys. So there we are. Now you can see again, it's two-thirds of the way there. So now the next location is right at the back of the map by Speed Cola. So you'll see this door here, 1250, I believe. Yeah, 1250. Let's splash the cash. Let's run up these stairs, take a left up these stairs. There's another door here, again, 1250. And this is where Speed Cola is. But more importantly, this is where the third and final lander location. <gasps> oh my god, they've, they've actually brought back the sickle. I thought it was going to be the Bowie knife. And once again, guys, you activate it for 250. It will return you to the spawn room. And the rocket is going to be fully primed. So let's go and launch it, shall we? There we go. So now you can see the rocket is fully primed. And uh, it's time to launch it. So let's go back to the power room. If, so you recognize this, yeah? Basically, you just come over, activate the launch sequence, and you'll see that rocket launch up into space. Now, if you have a ray gun, I believe you can actually shoot the rocket down, which is an achievement in itself. There we are. So get to rock, watch this beautiful rocket launch in next gen, and off it goes. And that is how you open up the pack punch. But I'm going to have to show you where pack punch is. So once you have launched the rocket, come out of the building. Come towards this fire trap, there's a big button here which shows you where the door is. And there's a sign here as well pointing you towards the Pack-A-Punch machine. And uh, if you come down here, this door on this frame here is normally blocked off until you launch the rocket. So you come in here and there it is. There's the Pack-A-Punch machine, 5,000 points I'm presuming, yes it is. 
So 5,000 points. And if you guys have found this very helpful and it's helping you pack a punch on the new map Ascent, well, not really the new map, but if you haven't played Ascension and it's going to help you pack a punch, be sure to leave a like. Let me know if you need any help with any other tutorials, if you want to see anything. If you have any other challenges you want us to do, whatever you want us to do, let me know in the comments. If this has helped you, leave a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I will see you in the next video, which is probably going to be like 10 minutes because there's so much stuff I need to cover. Cheers! Yes.